Hello my peaches, what's up? I am Pratha and welcome to today's video. Today I'm going to talk about some cozy fragrances since winters are going on and it is the best time to put on the cozy fragrances. Also, if you are a cozy fragrance lover like me, you would like to put these on every time you slip into your bed or at the night time or at the lovemaking time. Keeping that in mind, let's get into this list without wasting any more time and roll the intro. Do I need to repeat that? No, I need not repeat that. All of these are going to be cozy fragrances. So a very recent purchase, which comes off as a very comforting kind of fragrance to me, but more like I am awake and I am doing some things around the house, but I just want to feel cozy and comforted. So in that case, I like putting on almond blossom and oat milk. This is more of this florally, but still nutty slightly sweet and kind of smooth sort of a fragrance which is beautiful for putting on around the house and it's so beautiful guys it's um like it's not a long lasting fragrance but i think for putting it on myself around the house is kind of a great idea and i had my eyes on this fragrance for a very very long time and i just wanted to try it i don't know there is something about it it's a very smooth it has this oat kind of with, along with that slight lectonicness to it so it has this nutty and very oat like lectonicness kind of a thing going on in here along with some florals which is lifting it a little so yeah it is more um like on my skin it comes off a little perfumey which i am not mad about and uh, it's a very comforting kind of fragrance for me like good stay at home and smelling good and smelling cozy kind of fragrance for sure the best purchase in the cozy fragrances this year has to be brazilian crush shirosa 71 oh god guys this fragrance makes me smell like yummy. This, I don't know, for some reason, okay, I want to tell you that, you know, there is this something about these cozy and yummy fragrances that turns me on <laughs> for sure. And this definitely does that to me. It's a very yummy cookie dough like this. It smells like the cookie has just came out of the oven. That kind of fragrance, like a warm cookie that has just came out of the oven and more on the lines of shortbread so i've had a few shortbreads and that's what it reminds me of like that soft the the soft and fluffy shortbread which is in the shape of cookie so that is what it reminds me of like a vanilla cookie or something so it's so yummy it makes me smell good it makes me smell like a walking living cookie for sure and I love this fragrance, have been putting it on every now and then on myself and it stays around five to six hours on my fuzzy clothes, but not on my skin that much, but on the fuzzy clothes it does last. So have been loving this, have been going crazy over this. Beautiful fragrance guys, beautiful fra fragrance to consider if you want to smell yummy and cozy at the same time. Definitely worth the money for the kind of fragrance this is, but not for the packaging at all. Yeah, I have to just put it out there. A lighter and a fluffier version of it, just like another fluffier and cooled down version of Shirosa 71 is Happy Birthday from Bath & Body Works. It to me smells like this shortcake which has cooled down and is vanilla flavored. So this also is kind of similar to that, but is kind of missing that depth that smoothness warmth and depth in it so it's like a lighter fluffier version of it and is one tenth of the price of shirosa so i really cannot complain about the quality of the fragrance on this can't expect it to be like shirosa at all and on its own it's a nice cookie like a cooled down shortbread kind of fragrance in here with a kind of fluffiness in it which is coming from the cake icing note that it has but i think that note has been created by adding just a little bit of musk and a little bit of florals to it that's what i'm feeling about it because it's not coming off as a really warm kind of fragrance okay so it's like a cooled down soft doughy cookie which is again shortbread so yeah that kind of vibe it has so if you don't have the budget for shirosa 71 you can definitely consider it and enjoy having a gourmand 
cookie like fragrance in your collection for me personally this fragrance comes off as a cozy fragrance for sure and i love my sweet fragrances that do not disturb my sleep or anything in those lines so i love my bare vanilla line but have to say that for more on the cozier side of things i like bare vanilla untamed more than decadent and more than the original bare vanilla so this has this brown sugary sweetness to it and is thicker and denser and deeper compared to the original bare vanilla and i like this super sweet fluffy cozy kind of like this fuzzy vanilla that is in here i really really enjoy it and i can wear it to bed as well like without any doubts i can wear it to bed and feel no problems or issues at all and get a very good sleep with this beautiful sweet and brown sugary kind of deep fragrance in here next up we have another victoria secret fragrance which is warm and cozy this does might feel like it's a very warm fragrance but honestly it's more like this cozy staying at home kind of fragrance it's not like your calming you down sort of fragrance it's not that like i think bare vanilla untamed can do that shirosa 71 can do that and almond blossom and oat milk can as well do that but if you expect warm and cozy to calm you down and to put you in a good sleep that is not going to happen because of the reason that it has a very orangey note in the opening which they are uh, you know listing as passion fruit but it has this very oranginess to it and is kind of a uh, toasted coconutty fragrance which the coconut shines more on my skin instead of my clothes so if i really have to experience and smell that coconut in it i always have to put it on my skin and this is like a fresher take on a cozy and warm fragrance so i really don't get the point of that but it's because of the name reason and because of that slight coziness in it along with the fresh notes so because of that toasted coconut and soft vanilla in it so because of that reason i am putting it in this list so this can be your staying at home and putting on a cozy and uh you know a comforting fragrance basically but more on the fresher lines so this is more appropriate for being a cozy fragrance for the summer time that's what i feel about it i do not like putting it on for going to bed now because i have other things like shirosa and almond blossom and everything so i don't use it for bed because of that reason so it can be good staying at home kind of fragrance and smelling good kind of fragrance which will not get on your nerves and kind of just will stay there as a fuzzy cozy kind of fragrance a recent love of mine has to be basic vanilla from victoria secret again loving this fragrance like anything this is just another fragrance which is equally good for me just like Shirosa 71 I am getting the same kind of quality in here as well so Shirosa 71 is a cookie fragrance so this is a fragrance that has the notes of toasted marshmallow and warm chai this is just another fragrance that turns me on like anything it reminds me of the pink thick elaichi dood that we have every now and then in our households but in a very modern way not in like a traditional way so it has this super lictonicness to it from the chai notes and the sweet cardamom mixed with milk sort of a thing in here and then in the base it has toasted marshmallow so after that elaichi and that cardamom along with that lictonicness settles down it turns into a very very beautiful toasted marshmallow fragrance and it is smooth and lictonic and sweet through and through this is like my favorite favorite going to bed sort of fragrance because it does not last very long it calms me down it just turns me on and it's just so beautiful why have people not been talking about it so much i don't know i just love this elaichi milk thing that is going on in here so much so i would highly recommend that if there's one fragrance on a budget i am telling you to buy 
for slipping into your bed, feeling cozy, feeling like you are by the fireside, feeling like you're experiencing the extreme winters in the most sweet way possible, then that has to be basic vanilla from Victoria's Secret. Loving this. Loving this. Highly recommend this. Just go and get this. It's very much available in 990 rupees. One thing which is actually not a fragrance but a candle, I would highly recommend as a cozy fragrance candle for sure. And that has to be Pumpkin Pecan Waffles from Bath & Body Works. I just love this sweet bakery-like waffle fragrance in here. It's super sweet, guys. It's super sweet and you can already tell how much I have burnt this. I'm half ways down with this. I've been burning this back to back and I've been enjoying this so much while doing my work. This definitely is a candle that makes me crave sugar for sure, but I don't mind that. I can fight my cravings and enjoy some sweet fragrances for sure. And that's just one thing about me, okay? I can't have too much sugar because that causes me um, pain in my heels. So I always try keeping my sugar intake to just one tablespoon a day. Probably that's the reason I'm so crazy for all these sweet fragrances and I love them so much. So this is like you're, um, you know, having some cozy time, giving you yourself some calm and cozy vibes along with some sweet bakery like fragrance so it's great for that and that's pumpkin pecan waffles from bath and body Works. i am so sorry guys i have forgotten sitting here with the fragrance and that is vanilla bean noel from bath and body works if there's one fragrance from bath and body works which is like a no-brainer warm vanilla sweet fragrance for me then that has to be vanilla bean noel and it's just a toasted vanilla beans with some caramel kind of fragrance which is a little smoky as well so it's just another cozy comforting kind of fragrance for me it's hard to find a perfume which is super cozy like i have come across so many body mists that are cozy and that are like bakery like or go mond and super like on the super cozy side of things but i've never came across a perfume which is true uh go mond or true cozy kind of fragrance but we have an exception here and that is english bakery from nefarious this is just another bakery like fragrance it is the orange cake along with some coffee in it so probably like a orange cake served by the side of black coffee sort of fragrance in here it does not come off as a like a perfumey fragrance to me it comes off as a bakery like fragrance to me and it's super yummy and beautiful just that it does not last on me it lasts around i don't know one one and a half two hours nothing more than that but if you are looking for a cozy kind of fragrance and you are very much into uh, this sort of things and you want an indian made niche fragrance you must consider nefarious english bakery for sure some of you have bought it and not liked it and then some of you have bought it and liked it and also last on you quite long so it totally depends so i would highly suggest you that you buy the small decant first try this fragrance out if you like it enough then move on with buying the full bottle in it how can i leave out choco musk from al rehab when we talk about cozy fragrances this is a very simple super sweet slightly chocolatey but more on the vanilla musky side of things it's a super musky blending beautifully with the uh, skin kind of musk along with some super sweet vanilla more like this white chocolate mixed with vanilla and musky kind of fragrance and it's a beautiful going to bed or just you know having some cozy time kind of fragrance and beautiful yummy and amazing for the price you'll get it in just two or three hundred rupees for sure so if you're super you are on a very low budget right now and you want to buy something very cozy, sweet and yummy at the same time, must consider Al Rehab's Choco Musk. Talking about cozy fragrances and not including my recent purchase from Bath & Body Works, Fireside Flurries, how can that happen? This does have the lavender note to it, I agree, but this also is like fluffy, marshmallowy kind of fragrance with a bit of smokiness to it. So this is like your 
not maybe not slipping into the bed but more like enjoying a winter day by the fireside kind of fragrance in here and it's beautiful guys just that i personally cannot wear it for slipping into the bed because it's you know it's a, a little perfumey from the lavender that is there in it and which is lifting it a little and kind of making it perfumey and irritates my nasal tract in the bed not all day long but just in the bed so i like putting it on for the rest of the time but i do not wear those exact clothes for going to bed whenever i put this on but it's beautiful staying at home winter day kind of fuzzy cozy fragrance for sure a very beautiful recent discovery of mine is by sac very vanilla fragrance this is a sandal woody fragrance with vanilla in it this is just another like let's say you do not want to go towards the gourmand side of fragrances and you just want a cozy and a very calming kind of fragrance for yourself then i would highly recommend that you go for this slightly sweet vanilla woody fragrance which has a very beautiful creamy sandalwood in the base this would just calm you down like if you want you you're feeling anxiety you're feeling panicky just put this on you and you will instantly feel calm and everything so it's that kind of fragrance I really like putting it on myself guys. I mean, Bisac fragrances have blown my mind to be honest. Either I have uploaded it if I have not, I will upload it. I have a, a dedicated video for the Bisac body mist and a dedicated review on these so do check it out if i have uploaded it <laughs> yeah next up we have chocolate covered cherry from Bath and Body Works. I don't know when it will be back but since I have it I'm going to mention it. This is a very beautiful cherry chocolate cake fragrance. No brainer at all. It does have that doughiness in the opening, but then quickly settles into a fresh cherry cake like fragrance. And you will only like it if you like the cherry notes. It's definitely a through and through Gaumont fragrance and very, very yummy and beautiful, but slightly on the fresher side of things like cake like fragrance, but with a chocolatey and cherry note to it so yeah again a cozy fragrance a staying at home fragrance or a love making fragrance for sure like because you will be smelling edible after putting this on fragrance that you guys have been hating but i personally have been loving is pear creme brulee from bath and body works love this one guys for staying at home for just smelling like tonic with a pear note to it it has this kind of a babu gosha note to it it's more like this pulpy pear which is more like babu gosha that we get easily in indian markets along with some like toniness like some custardiness to it so it does turn out nasty on me as well in the summertime it is not something to be putting on in these summers but it is more of this winter time fragrance which is beautiful which is um very very like tonic and custody along with some freshness from that pulpy pear so a smooth fragrance through and through and very cozy and comforting kind of fragrance not at all go without mentioning tobacco collection rich warm and addictive from zara this is a beautiful tobacco dark coconutty fragrance with a honey sweetness to it very much out of the box kind of fragrance but this is more like my go to fragrance when i'm on my period when i am like this and bare vanilla untamed or decadent or whatever or um also basic vanilla so these fragrances they really just you know help me with going through those difficult painful days always my go to kind of fragrance for the period days for some reason because it is warm and sweet like honey dripping sweet and warm but then has this dark coconutiness to it along with the tobacco note to it and some woodiness in the base it's a very calming fragrance for sure more like this it has this zen feel to it for me for me personally i'm not saying that it will come off as that for everyone but it has this zen feel to it for me personally so i love putting this on in my period days another comforting sweet cozy calming fragrance for me i don't know if this next fragrance is still available on the website but that is zara pink flambe it's a very very simple sweet white chocolate fragrance with lychee note to it so it is 
slightly bright from but not as like super bright but kind of slightly bright from the lychee like juicy and sweet and then super sweet from white chocolate so those are the two notes that i smell in it prominently has a bit of musk as well but i just feel that this is so much like you know sweet no brainer kind of fragrance just kind of uh, feeling calm and cozy and at home sort of a thing in here so it's really nice and it's really beautiful if you're looking for something cozy in zara women's section you must consider this one and the last fragrance that i want to talk about honestly guys i'm so tired right now i don't know why it's just the process of getting ready doing the setup and preparing for the video is just so long that it exhausts me when i to when i do these long videos so i filmed two videos today and it has completely exhausted me i'm just feeling like lying down right now and not even eating or anything but that's not how life goes i'll have to you know all this mess here i have to uh, put everything back to its respective places and undress get into my home clothes and everything and then eat as eating is very important i'm just not feeling the energy for that but yes on to the last fragrance now and that is strawberry pound cake how can i not mention this fragrance this is a beautiful strawberry cake like fragrance smells like a true fresh cake on your skin so not on the warm side of things but more like the fresh cakey kind of things in here but very beautiful very gourmand but more on the fresher lines of things not really like warm or anything so but i just really enjoy it i think this is one super sweet cake like fragrance that you can think about putting on in the summer nights as well so that's the kind of thing is that is in here and i love this fragrance again have not been reaching out for it too much because i have so many good things right now like shirosa and basic vanilla and bare vanilla and what not but but for a cake like and if you're a strawberry lover so a cake like strawberry fragrance it has to be there in your collection and that's what ends the list for my cozy and calming fragrances to stay at home or slip into the bed and i hope you found something for yourself in this list and i hope you liked and enjoyed this video and if you're still here watching me and liking me don't forget to give this video a big fat thumbs up down below don't forget to subscribe to be my peaches Keep looking beautiful, keep smelling good and have a great day all. Bye bye. Mwah.